Welcome back, machine mask wearing folks. This is near Automata, where your cosplay may not be welcome, while the resistance camp, of which we become fond of in this game, is now under attack, apparently. It has been rather peaceful this whole time, populated with vendors and upgraders and chip users and jukeboxes, but now is not even accessible by transport. We have to answer the distress call immediately. Mm. Mm. Hello, small machines. They are hopping about. There's also a kind of a haunting tone taken on by the MIDI music that we've come quite familiar with also playing this game. Why are their numbers increasing? And why are they doing that? Try contacting the bunker via laser relay system. Affirmative. Not all is well in Gingerbread Town. Mm. Uh, these machines are still following you. You should kill them before entering the camp. No! Uh, guys, you you don't you don't want to walk that guys. You can't. You can't. They're trying to eat them. You There's can't eat if you... Uh, to be. I mean, for all intents and purposes, they're just basically, like, just smothering them. But they have blood on their faces and their bodies, which suggests that they have blood on their hands, and we must destroy every last one of them. Now, I'm not going to suggest that one of the alternative endings should have been not uh, uh, to be succumbing, uh, succumbing to uh, auto cannibalism because, you know, that's just uh, something that uh, would be seen as incredibly weird and uh, out of place for, for a character. But I am saying that it would be an interesting concept to explore. That every uh, hub world at some point should become like the vortex nexus to hell the of course the the final five levels of bro force an enemy say things to be yes <laughs> you okay they came out of nowhere overran the entire camp we tried to fight back but our Can't shots have no effect move shields detected on multiple enemy fighters physical attacks recommended got it. you get the other androids out of here good luck bye an enemy do what must be done must beat up noobs so how factual was uh, uh was his readout was whose readout uh uh, uh pod's readout that physical attacks are recommended. Well, physical attacks are working. No, no, not that physical attacks are recommended. That their energy shields are are making our shots uh, ineffective. Uh, bullcrap! It's just dramatic hoop hoopla. Just kill them. <laughs> <laughs> or maybe it's the fact that our pod is better than their weapons. Gerda, your insides would be twisting at the idea that your home has come under attack. Your home. In the storage room where the android sleeps, where we go to the jukebox to play with our toys. Well, to be does not consider the resistance base home. It, it's it's a home away from home. We've got friends here. I mean, it's a good it's a good supply waypoint certainly, but it's definitely not a place where she feels at home. Mind you, to be doesn't feel at home anywhere. So. <laughs> She can't wait to kill the god who made this whole ridiculous formula possible. Uh, Android man, you should probably get out of here. Immediately. Come, come now. Get out of the background. Okay, now get everybody out of here. You saved our lives. <laughs> and what's going on here? I have no idea. They came out of nowhere and just... Huh? That was outside the camp. 
Of course that was outside the camp. None of the buildings fall, fell on us. Why is there an item on the roof? What was that noise? Ah, damn it. It's the Goliath bot that we just fought. Uh, it's, it's twin, actually. I know, I know, but uh, the difference here is that it has environmental advantages that ow, we don't ow, get access ow. to. Thank you, anti-chain damage. <laughs> Although anti-chain damage did not help you uh, that much against the, uh, the environmental uh, damage there. It did help me against repeated attack, which is because water conducts electricity. Uh, 2B, you sh this is, uh, this is a late game boss. You might want to raise your health about 45% before it shits on your life. <laughs> uh, for the record, despite it saying it's a late game boss, I had difficulty believing that the game is supposed to end at level, at level 30. Of course it's not that, supposed uh, to end at level 30, but that's because, what, but we haven't gotten to that part yet. We still have to finish the first campaign. Thanks. Next pod. You know, maybe. <laughs> Great suggestion, bro. I'll give it a shot. Oh my god, my health is low. Well. Um, so, this I like to think at this point that this game wants to leave you hungry. It makes you want that second sh whole shot at this game because the first one maybe didn't give you quite as much as you were hoping for. Oh, I do have auto heal. Nice. Uh oh, him's doing him's doing the Bakugan thing. Roll, roll, roll in the hay. That's the young Frankenstein thing. And here it comes. Whoosh. It's an attack, not a movement. Oh shit! Thank you. Uh, why I can't? Oh, you can't. Oh, okay, so you can't access the inventory. You just hit the wrong button for it. No, actually, I, I hit the same button, but the timing was incorrect because you're not allowed to access the pause menu while you're doing an animation. Ah, okay. You are not good at dodging that particular shockwave. I mean, there's just a lot of shit going on. Like, I want to kill the robots. Although I it's a lot of shit going on, you can, no, you can mostly ignore the. You can mostly ignore the. Uh, I know. The, uh, the smaller, fr the small fry. I apologize. I'm just making excuses for myself. It's. I mean, it is. Of course, it's my fault that I suck at this game. Better players would not take the hits. There are difficulty settings that motivate you to not get hit at all because you can't get hit more than once. <laughs> A two B don't. Uh, two B must die mode. Right. She's gonna blow. No, she sparked us. Two B. God damn it, nine ass. He had no health left. This is just inappropriate and stupid. But it's good to see you again. Ouch! 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 Hey, he's fine. You okay? Good thing I landed that direct. Just needed a minute to catch his breath while. You die. Hey, oh, hey, you I was right. Die. Eve was piloting it. Haha. <laughs> well, Eve is. Adam was controlling one half of the network, and Eve, of course, was controlling the the the, the two N D half. <laughs> All right, so it's time for the king uh, for the Kingdom's Hearts three boss, right? <laughs> What's the Kingdom Hearts 3 boss? Uh, specifically the the heartless the heartless storm. Yeah, you could say the machine is a pretty good comparison to the to the heartless. Thank you, anti chain damage. <laughs> I'm not entirely sure you need it here. You just need to find out. You just need to find oh, the uh, the good pattern. Two, the good pattern three. and stay in, in the safe zone. Because I mean, there's definitely a safe zone uh, in that attack. It doesn't look like yeah. there's supposed to be, but there definitely is one. Yeah, it's, a, it's a, well, you you create them with the dodge system, basically. Right. So enemies. So this is just his shield that we're damaging, right? This isn't his actual health bar. I don't know where the. I mean, is, it, is he is he inside the orb? 
Uh, like, well, Eve specifically is inside the orb. You can, you can tell his model is actually there. Motherfuckers of magic, because as I recall, Adam like assem assembled himself just using a pile of silicate cubes. And then poof, he appears. Whereas Eve is using spheres. And anger. Right, so just again, when when he does the star storm, just yeah, just spam the dodge button. It's the correct move. Um, pick up the energy core. Oh, important stuff is happening. Behold the Kingdom Hearts 3 boss. The swar the storm of Heartless. Small also, it's a giant worm from uh, from World of Warcraft. They're still coming? Of course they're still coming. What do we uh, do? No, where's There's the machine many. core? You bastards! Chubby? They Chubby, actually took you away you the machine core, that kinda sucks. Pascal? Come in, Pascal! Shit! Not this, Pascal! This, we like her! Language to be. We got this. <sighs> and we're running. You know, if we if we were playing uh, Metal, Metal Gear Rising Revengeance, you could actually use ninja <laughs> running in order to run up the buildings. I mean, this is basically ninja running. You can, I mean, if you have, I mean, by now you might have your alternate your alternative chip arrangement set up. So all you have to do is just switch from Type A to Type B, and then you got your movement speed plus and your dodge and your evade distance plus and so forth. Let's take these guys out first. And evidently Pascal's idea of barricading the village is pushing the block back the other way. Well, it seems to be working. They're having trouble getting through the barrier. That oh, oh shit, he jumped back up. Nice level up. Well, one a lot of enemies to kick ass, and to think that if I was if I was actually using a weapon it would take longer. Damn it, he's still alive. Die. Kick you off the edge. You bastard. Mm. So what happened there is he, uh, as he fell into the no contact zone, and they had to teleport him back to a, to a uh, to a reasonable position, so the gyro worm event could happen. Right. <laughs> oh, we we're in the right place at the right time. Now let's fight. So how many cores is this giant worm made, uh, made of? I'm seeing at least four? Uh, one. Yeah, I think it's just the one core. Almost got it. Nope. Ah, oh, the heart. Admittedly, I'm not seeing a health bar when, uh, when he goes up. Uh, when he gets uh, knocked out like that. Um. Yeah, you're right. There wasn't a health bar there. Oh, the PK Star Storm. Most important thing, of course, is that you just keep hitting it. Until that happens, and then it explodes. You saved us. Oh, thank you so much. We rescued the village. Yeah. Machines on the network all went berserk at the same moment. I think the unit presiding over them may have gone mad. It's Eve. It's gotta be. Yes, it does, Miss uh, Nine S. Will it stop the rest? Most likely, yes. Pod, I need you to locate Eve's current position. Location has been detected and placed on map. How the fuck Look do we have e uh, Eve's signature? Because Eve is just that fucking and Actually, as a matter of fact, that's Eve trying to... No, that's Pascal trying to uh, transmit to us. And in the next part, then Eve is going to try to transmit to us because he's got things to tell us, but we may not listen. Be safe, everybody.